What is up and welcome back everybody. On this episode, we are back at my favorite little spillway. Like I said before, it's not super little, but it holds really big fish. Super excited. A couple weeks ago, we caught a trophy master angler walleye at 28 and a half inches. Today, we're gonna be trying to do that. Maybe catch one a little bit bigger. We're gonna be throwing this purple and black glide bait prop duster. Got a really good rattle to it. This little spinny silver thing in the middle. We're gonna help attract fish. So you never know. We're gonna start launching these baits. Get straight into it. I'm just gonna hook up my portable charger to myself. So where you can just continuously run footage, no stop, another raw and uncut. Let's get it. You man, little little cloudy, little bit of wind. Always perfect conditions for really great walleye fishing. What I really like about this bait is that it's a slow sink. This area has tons of snags, lots of rocks, and lots of weeds. This is a glide bait, so it does a really nice S turn. As well as you can pop this bait, and it does a very cool darting action. I haven't used this bait very much, and I should more if I'm out here trying to catch big fish. Sink just a little bit, float in the current, pop, 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 pop. Sink, pop, 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 pop. Oh, that was a fish. Nothing big, but that was a fish. There was a bit of a swirl on the top of the water. That's exciting, that's pretty, pretty cool. Like four, three, four casts in. Always really good sign. That these fish are active today. Now, another tough thing that's gonna play is the wind and that it actually blows my line a little bit. So I don't get the reaction I want and I can't see the strikes as good. Now, I picked a bit of a darker lure today. Oh, oh, that is big. That is really big. I feel these head shakes in there. They're big. That's a nice walleye. Oh, yes. Oh, that is fantastic. That did not take long at all on this glide bait, but it just shows you <laughs> that these, these fish are predators in dark conditions. That is so freaking awesome. Now, his weight tricked me and he thought, I thought he was a little bit bigger, but really good sign that even just after a couple casts we had one and now even this one that's freaking awesome oh man I'm having trouble right now apparently there we go one last look oh yeah there you go whoa oh he's stuck there There you go. Sweet. That's one in the bag. Not bad. I have my net just in case we get something really big. And I mean, there, there are big ones in here. I've caught big ones. We're gonna try and just <laughs> keep this camera rolling as fast and as much as we can. Just to show you, like this spot is crazy on the right day. Like that was only a few casts, which is nuts. 
It's always important to have those little pauses. Uh, yeah, the little pauses are very important. That's when most fish actually strike your lure. So, you know, it's important to cast where you want to cast, but retrieving is an art. Pop, pop, pop. Pause, pop, pop, pause. Weeds. My dog is watching me. Hi, Bella. <laughs> She's so cute. I love her. Oh, that is an. Oh, oh, this is big. <laughs> Are you serious right now? Are you freaking serious right now? Oh, this might be Pike actually. Oh no, that's another walleye. This is a walleye slam right now. Oh yeah, they love this glide bait, dude. Freaking rights. Freaking rights. Paul Lee and I'm falling into the rocks. Oh man, look at the gold colors on that one, dude. Oh man, that's freaking sweet. Holy, that's a perfect looking fish if I've ever seen one. <laughs> Holy. Oh no, my pliers go. Oh man, what a guy. Sheesh. Get my sleeve wet, that's okay. I'm telling you, on these crappy days when you think it's not even gonna bite good, they bite good. Look at that. Oh, that's freaking awesome. There you go, bud. Whew. That's two within whatever time I've been here. That's, that's sweet. Tell me about this purple glide bait. I don't know what it is, but they're loving it. First time ever fishing a glide bait for walleye. It's pretty insane. And uh, I'm a huge fan. I'm gonna get more of these. I really wanna film more of these raw and uncut videos because really it just gives you a perspective on either just how crazy a day can be out here or even just like how slow it can actually be. Uh, oh man, got caught in whatever string that was. There's a lot of fish in here right now. Holy. Pause, pop and pause. It's all about the pause. Like that's when you're gonna get those hits. Now it's important to know that with the current your bait always moves down. Now you want to cast up and it seems like a very simple, simple idea but if you cast straight you're now retrieving through the rocks in very shallow and you're probably going to get snagged up. Okay, just gonna let that sink a little bit. We're gonna, you know, just let it do its thing. Pop, 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 couple pops. 
Slow retrieve. Bop. Wait. Bop. Wait. I think I'm hitting weed. Yeah. Darn. Oh, right against the wall there. What is my dog doing? <laughs> Lauren, she's so funny, she's so curious about life and stuff, so neat, so nice to see. I didn't quite think of that when I kind of cast it where I did. There we go. <laughs> Bella! Oh, pretty girl. This is so good. by the rocks. They're aggressive today. It's got to be the little silver flash too. It spins as well as vibrates and glides. It's, it's kind of a really neat, neat bait. It's really cool. Oh. oh, I saw a fish jump over there. And at the same time, something just smacked this. Oh, yes. Oh, nice big head shakes. Nice walleye. Nice walleye. Oh, oh yes. Come here. Oh, that's perfect.
Nope. Don't you get away. Now, I have a net for a reason, <laughs> but clearly I'm not using it. And uh, it might sewer me. So this one's actually pretty big. We're gonna go and measure it. We're actually gonna use the net right now. Let's get it out of there. Like this is a really nice fish. Like she's uh, looking close to trophy to be honest. Oh wow, barely hooked, crazy. Crazy, crazy. Just to transport this girl better. A little more safer and more comfortable and not just right by the gills and something nasty. I'll be honest, I've done it before, done that before, but I try not to. Sometimes you just get caught up in the moment. Oh yeah, I don't think she's a trophy, but she's pretty darn nice size. No, I don't think it is, but... Chill it out! The faster you let me do this, the faster it's gonna just go. Oh no. Yeah. 24. Uh, yeah, like I said, not even close, but I wanted to wanted to check because I mean, oh, big size, big size fish. That's awesome. Freaking sweet. That was crazy. Same time, like there was a fish jump over there. This thing smacked it. Oh yeah, that was freaking awesome. Beautiful. There he goes. Send him off. Woo! Oh man, a ton of fish this morning. Woo! I love that. That's so fun. Oh man. I really dickered my setup. If you understand that reference, that is one pug life. Hilarious bunch of Canadians that used to just double decker pliance jump on crappy little go karts. And uh, I wish they made more videos like that, but like, like us all, they just get old and can't be doing that stuff anymore because it gets really dangerous. Double decker pliance jump. So, so funny. OnePugLive.com <laughs> Doodly do! <laughs> oh man, they're just, they're just so funny. You can tell they're on something. There's, they have one video where uh, this was before uh, marijuana was legalized in Canada. <laughs> the cop pulls him over and he's like, well, I smell weed. He's like, uh, yeah, I got, yeah, I got a couple joints in my pocket here, and uh, it's just the whole, the whole thing is just so funny, so so funny. I'm really happy I can do this right now for everybody because to to film a raw and uncut walleye video, trust me, is not an easy task. Sometimes you'll go, you'll be out on the water for six hours and catch two or be on the hour, in the water for an hour and catch like 20. Like it really depends on the day. Um, and, and really, like you see, like I just have like perfect conditions right now. Uh, we're still looking for that really, really big fish because that'd be super exciting i could just end the day right there if i wanted to um 
Like, really, like that's that'd be crazy. Another trophy fish. Like, imagine that. Like, imagine like a 31 or 32 inch walleye. Like, to hit the 30 club in general is just insane, but. That's crazy! That's crazy! Holy, okay, this, this one, this one feels nice. This one feels nice. It had a little bit of a run. It gave up. Ah, pike. Darn it! Actually, you know what? Totally fine. Totally fine. We're a little multi-species uh, day here. Woo! Woo! Doodly doo! Oh yeah! And honestly, it just felt heavier because it just like it caught up in a little bit of weed right there, as you can see. And that's cool. Oh yeah, nice one. And uh, you know, doing pike things and broke it. That's cool. Doodly do, doing stuff. Asshole. Oh. Well, I don't see it there, but I got one more in the truck. We're gonna go put that on. At the same time, say hi to the dog. Now, it's not a dark colored one. It's, it's a rainbow trout colored. Uh-huh, total hazard walking on these rocks. Always be careful. Take your time, some of them are loose. And if it's raining, just don't even bother because wet rock sucks. We got one more of these. Pretty neat. Right here. Same thing, but it's a little rainbow trout. And the inside is spinning red instead of silver. Which, uh... Now I don't got my pliers. Hmm. That's not good. I really got not got them? What? What? Huh. Okay, so this this actually might be where I have to cut the video just so I can find these pliers. Hey look at that! Found them! I don't know how, but they were under this box and I really don't understand how my little stupid little brain did that, but we're okay. We're uh, back in business. Okay, let's go do this thing. One small cut back over there just to get uh, the lure back on. Get back fishing, cool. Okay, there's something going on with my GoPro here. It says it's to keep preparing a file. I'm not sure what that means, but pretty silly. Anyways, we're back, we're hooked up. Rainbow trout colorway i have no idea if these fish are even going to like this because the middle piece is not silver and i that might have been what really was driving these fish to go so nuts and if that's it for the day well you know that's not bad we caught five in like almost no time at all which is crazy yeah see it doesn't got the flash like the other one does but we're gonna see if we can oh wow nice bird the wind is really picking up here. It's really... Oh! Speak... Nice! <laughs> it still works! <laughs> it still works! This has got a little bit of weight to it, and this is nice. It's got some weight, and it's freaking nice. Yes! Oh! 
Oh, that's another really, really nice walleye. Keep the tension on that. Yes. Well, they love the rainbow trout. <laughs> They'll eat rainbow trout. Oh, thrash away, bud. You keep thrashing away. You're caught. Silly guy. Haha. <laughs> oh man, that's a. I don't know, that's a nice fish. We gotta measure this one too. First one on the trout is freaking nice size. I don't know if it's. It's gotta be close, but I don't think it is. Oh man, nice healthy fish. Oh yeah. Nice hook up there. Holy, that's a freaking nice fish. All right. Tip of the tail is always longer, so you want to move it out. 25 inch, 25 inch walleye, that's freaking awesome. Oh yeah. That's the biggest one today. Now I'm just ignoring my rod, I'm just going to leave it there, get this thing back. Oh, almost slipped. Oh, that's awesome. That's a great, great picture. Oh, sick. There he goes. Oh, yeah. That is so many big walleyes today. Where's the 28? Oh, man. Sheesh! That's just crazy. Well, they like the rainbow trout. I didn't think that was going to happen, to be honest. I was doubting the, the trout. <laughs> but, don't dump the trout. As they say. <laughs> uh, who says that? No one. Except me. And that's fine. And don't forget your pliers again. Pliers, need those. Man, I'm just breathing heavy here. Just <laughs> <laughs> oh man, you move around on all these rocks. Like you, you expend quite a bit of energy here. Pretty neat. Bop, bop, bop. There we go, back to the spot. Sweet. Man, trust in the rainbow trout, eh? Trust the rainbow trout. The different colorway it might be the difference to keep fishing to be honest just to keep it fresh for these fish and they're not seeing that bait over and over and over again go through the same water column they're like man this thing is fake if i saw it catch a few of my friends but now the trout is out and like ah freshy i don't know we'll see will it catch me a master angler i don't know Oh, 
Oh, oh, those are big head shakes. Those are big. Those are big. Are you serious? No way. Oh, that's a giant. That's a giant. The rainbow trout. That's a giant. Come here. Oh, maybe not a giant, but that's a big, big one. Oh, yes. Look at that. Look at this size. Are you kidding me? Back to back. Are you kidding me? Oh, that's a giant. That's a huge walleye. And these hooks are just incredibly sharp. That's unreal. That did not take long. It's just so flared up right now. Give me a sec, bud. I got you. I got you. Oh, he rehooked himself. God damn it. Oh, that's another nice walleye. Oh, the big ones are out to play today. Freaking cool. Twenty seven inch walleye. Oh, my God. What a huge day out here. Damn, 27 inch walleye. Oh, Lee, trust in the rainbow trout. Let's go. Let's go. Man, that's just crazy. That's crazy. Ah, I thought I was going to catch another trophy master angler on that one. Man, nuts. Freaking nuts. Wow. Come on, where is the 30 incher? Right in the middle, kind of just. I need to get to my rock. That is my rock. I don't know what it is. 
probably superstitious, but that's my rock. Just chilling. That's so funny. Hey, Bella. Oh, it's starting to get brighter now. A little brighter. The bite might be slower now because it's brighter out. Just specifically, you know, it's been a little bit and that's all it takes for them to just turn off until the evening. That's such a cool... Just doing really fast, like double twitch. Trying it out. Give it a sec. wondering why that bait wasn't feeling how it was supposed to. So a little bit of gunk on the on the trebles really does it. Yeah, the bite might be over. I don't know, it's a lot brighter now. Like considerably brighter.
Oh, sheesh. Oh, man, I went to the rocks. A crazy long cast. This is a really funky lure. I really want to know what would happen if I put this on um, a bottom bouncer. I trolled along the bottom with a bottom bouncer. Like, in the main lake. I kind of want that vortex one again. That one, that one was crazy, but this, these two, this colorway caught the big fish, so I don't know. It's like that little circle silver flash that really just made the difference. I don't know. It might be over. Let's see. Give it a few more. Right in the weeds. In a while, compared to what the bite was, they're going deep. They had their, uh, I don't know. Yeah, that might be it. We're gonna give it the benefit of the doubt. We're gonna give it a few more. And if that's it, well, hey, that was a freaking sweet day. Yes! 
Oh, 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 oh. oh, that one's flying. That one's flying. This one's got a ton of energy here. Oh, man. You don't get caught in that. Please don't get caught in that. There we go. We got around it. How did this little walleye <laughs> have such fight? Wow, look how gold he is. Ah, a little benefit of the doubt. Freaking sweet, man. All right. Oh, hey. Raw and uncut walleye fishing here, as you can see. Pretty crazy. Oh, oh. Just on that little pause. Just smacked it. Barely even hooked. Hey, just so effortlessly. That's awesome. That's awesome. Kind of foamy. Man, I love how gold they get. Wow. This spot never ceases to amaze me. It's one of my favorite onshore fishing spots of all time. Give it a few more and maybe call it a day. The bite seems to really, really slow down here. Man, this glide bait's really cool though. Definitely gonna order some more. Hey, you never know. Maybe I'll get a, re a sponsorship using these, these baits. It's almost like you gotta really slow it down now. Like pause, pause, or pull, pull, pause, like longer pauses. But that just runs you into more weeds, really. Talking to me. Pretty cute. Hey, Bella. <laughs> Crazy girl, beautiful here in the valley. Oh man, it's sweet. Oh, pretty, pretty nice here. Oh, 
Oh wow, what's that? Oh, that's pretty cool. Hey, oh, oh. Oh, that's something you don't see every day. Like a, a deer. I think it's a deer. A dead deer. Pretty cleaned out. Right by the water. Oh. <laughs> Come here. No. Hey. There you go. Quite a, quite a neat hide she found. Hey, you want that? No. Sorry. This way. Come on. Come on. Come on. That's pretty neat. That's a really cool find to uh, end the, the fishing day here. Thanks for tuning in on this episode of Freshwater Fishing with Adrian. On, and on this special day, raw and uncut walleye fishing, a first for me. I'm really happy I could do this for you. So thank you for keep tuning in to these videos of mine that I keep making and uh, support from all of you. And have a great day. You.